Hallelujah, praises to the Almighty Lord God in heaven. Language a major role. Before God Yeshua Messiah's secret coming, language will play a major role. Let's see about this from the Word of God, the Bible. At present the human population is very high. God wanted people to be scattered in groups and live in different places of the world with peace as written in Genesis chapter 9. 1. And God blessed Noah and his sons, and said unto them, Be fruitful, and multiply, and replenish the earth. But people instead of living in peace, are gathering together and rebelling against God as written in Genesis chapter 11. 4. And they said, Go to, let us build us a city and a tower whose top may reach unto heaven, and let us make us a name, lest we be scattered abroad upon the face of the whole earth. They are now trying to make one language system as written in Genesis chapter 11. 1. And the whole earth was of one language, and of one speech. In the olden days, they did the same thing by uniting all people at one place and had only one language. So God scattered them out of that place to different places as written in Genesis chapter 11. 8. So the Lord scattered them abroad from thence upon the face of all the earth. And they left off to build the city. Now countries are again getting united under one language system. The computer digital language. Uniting for good purpose and living with God is good. But this language will be used during Antichrist period to control the world for seven years period. It will be used against God by implementing the mark of the beast. This is against God's plan. So God will destroy this one language system with his return and the world administration will come to an end. A pure language will come praising the Almighty Lord God as written in Zephaniah chapter 3. 9. For then will I turn to the people a pure language, that they may all call upon the name of the Lord, to serve him with one consent. With this the thousand years reign by God Yeshua Messiah, followed by the eternal kingdom of God, the heaven. So if you want to be in the God's kingdom, you need to. Accept Yeshua Messiah as your God and Savior. Leave out all your sinful activities. Confess your sin to an apostle. Get water baptism and spiritual baptism. Meditate on his holy words. Do and live as per his holy words. The Gospel. Watch and wait for his holy call. Amen.